Hey guys, so I just wanted to um, talk a little bit about uh, the workshop that I go into schools and give. So the first thing I do is I, I do a performance based on the inner critic and the inner motivator and then I get everyone to close their eyes. And if you want to do this now, you can because it's pretty cool. So you close your eyes and you visualize your inner critic. What do they look like? What do they sound like? What are they wearing? Like they might look like a monster or they might just look like you, but a bit evil or something like that. Um, and so the thing is to start listening to them and what are they saying to you? What are all the mean things that this inner critic part of you is telling you? So it might be telling you things like you're not good enough. How can you think that you could possibly do that? She's better than you. He's better than you. Um, you know, you're not worthy. You can't do it. So just take a couple of minutes and pause this video and really close your eyes and go in and, and really see that part of you. And after you've done that, I want you to write down all the things that your inner critic has said. So all of those things, just get it all out on paper because really when you see it, you can go, oh, it's really not the truth and it's actually just my mind and a part of me. So after you've done that, I want you to close your eyes again and I want you to go into your heart and drop in. And see the part of you called the inner motivator. Now this part of you is your soul. It's there to encourage you and tell you all the good things that sometimes you might not really hear and you might just hear a little whisper. So see if you can close your eyes and visualize this part of you. What are they wearing? How does this part of you look? You could call this part your wise self, your heart. And just listen to this part of you speak. So your inner motivator might say things like, you can do it, you are worthy, you're amazing, you're intelligent, you're beautiful, you are loving, you are loved. So just close your eyes, pause this video and take a couple of minutes and really listen. And when you've done that, write down everything that part of you wants you to know. And then I want you to see those two columns and go, what is the truth for me? Do I want to believe my inner critic and do I want to go around my day listening to this part of me and being in that low energy or do I want to build myself up and have that high vibe energy where everyone's attracted to me because I know I'm worthy so those are the two main voices that we kind of you know we go from daily um, even you know when we're doing a test or when we're studying or we're going for a job interview or on a date there's heaps of times where these voices come in so it's really about catching that inner critic and then going, actually, thanks for talking, but I'm going to actually listen to this inner motivator instead because that's the truth of who I am. So, yeah, I hope that that helped you guys um, a little bit. I hope that you can get something out of that visualization. Really take a couple of minutes when you're feeling down and listen to what the critic wants to say because the critic's only saying things because it feels like it's not being listened to. So just address it and just write it all out and then go, thanks for speaking. Um, and I know you're a part of me, but I'm going to actually choose to listen to this part of me that knows better. And that's the truth for me. So my soul. And yeah, and then the more you do that, the more it becomes easier as you live your day. You can just catch that voice and just turn it over to your heart. So thanks for listening. I hope that um, it helped you. I'd love to hear if it did. I'd love to hear your feedback and um, check in with more things we're doing because we're taking lots of people on this amazing journey at the moment with our documentary called You're Enough and they're kind of discovering that you know they have more than just this critical voice. Thanks guys.